Now, the first time I did this, I actually broke a rib. Yeah, hilarious. Um, lucky for me, it wasn't one of mine. There was somebody standing exactly where you are. <laughs> right, here we go. I knew that I could become a trick shot artist the day I discovered that I could play left-handed. I'd just given a lesson to a left-hander. I was already an assistant pro and I borrowed his club and, and practiced away and it went so well that first time out on the course I shot 40 for nine holes and decided that I was going to become a left-handed golfer. And in the back of my mind was the fact that I'd never seen, a, I'd seen golf shows before, but I'd never seen anybody who could switch hit and, and that has become my uh, uh, my USP, if you like, the thing that differentiates my show is that I, I am two golfers in one body. I found it all incredibly natural and if you're going to perform something in front of a live audience you can't be thinking too, uh, too technically like, uh, like some people get caught up in, in, in normal golf. It wasn't like that for me at all. I just found I could, uh, I could do it. It was a happy knack that didn't require a lot of practice so uh, uh, it's been fairly reliable, uh, luckily. Right, relax. So first tee. Relax, slow it down to a blur and hold the floor through. Tall pros really like watching trick shots. I've been really surprised by the feedback that I've got when I've gone to European tour events or uh, performed at Golf Live uh, or, or clinics with, with top players. They're all very keen to have a go uh, and they love doing it. And the thing is, it's really not what like they do at all. It's, it's a completely different skill. They, uh, and and they, like, they like golf as well. I mean, they're golf fans, so uh, they love having a go. Three. Two, one. Oh! Very good. Well, when you go to a, a, a golf show performed by a professional trick shot artist, what you want to see is the ball being struck really well, but most of all, you want to be entertained. And I think that's what people love. They love to laugh and they love to the, see the flight of the ball when it's struck really well. And when you come to a, a show with a professional golf trick shot artist, that is what hopefully what you'll, what you'll see. The best trick shots of all the tour pros were, um, Monty was pretty good at the, uh, at the high tee, did that with uh, him at Golf Live. Uh, met Paul Drake Harrington on a, a corporate day in, uh, in Portugal and he was really good at Happy Gilmore. Uh, Thomas LeVay very good at the high tee and uh, Nick Doherty too. Uh, but one thing they were universally dreadful of, uh, uh, we did this at Golf Live, was the Edward Scissorhands trick. Nobody can seem to, to get that. So, you know, some of them can do some of it, but uh, very few can do can do all of it, but they're very sporting when they have a go. My favourite trick shot has got to be Happy Gilmore, uh, which I only discovered in Australia because some kids said, can you do Happy Gilmore? I'd never heard of the film. They said, well, it's running up and hitting a ball. And I thought, well, I'll have a go. And suddenly there, I got a trick shot. So um, you can find inspiration from all kinds of different sources, which I, I constantly do. I look for, for new things all the time, new ways of expressing it, new shots to hit. And, uh, but that's my, that's my absolute favourite. There we go.